gonna have a little bit of a mukbang moment. I've got this huge salad, as you can see, gherkins, a salad box, cucumber, pickled onions, and two pieces of mackerel because I really want to, you know, up my protein intake and for me, there's not really much that's better than having a massive piece of fish and two pieces might be a lot, but I absolutely adore it, I do. Um, on my salad, I've got baba sauce and then on the mackerel, I've just put a little bit of soya sauce on because it's just not the way I kind of like it. I mean, I do, I love it regardless if it has the soy sauce on it or not. But I definitely am a little bit more partial to it when it's got the soy sauce on. <laughs> Let me just move a little bit. Um, I'm going to have to maybe do a little switcheroo and mind my water out of the way. Is that a little bit better? Maybe? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> anyway, I am so hungry, so I just really want to get into it as fast as humanly possible. There we go. I'm not cutting off my head so much. <laughs> Bizarrely enough, when we were in Sainsbury's, they didn't have any broccoli at all, period. So I'm like, well, what am I going to have for dinner? And I ended up picking up some eggs. Um, so I'm going to have a couple of boiled eggs with my noodles. because for the time being, I'm over having them fried. I really am. But yeah, it was some um, really slim pickings in Sainsbury's today. <clears throat> Which isn't really like the greatest for me especially when you're trying to get fresh produce the Sainsbury's that we go to is always a little bit iffy um, on what stock they have available. But I'm definitely grateful for being able to get what, what I could. <laughs> I looked at the peppers today and they had one and it was all that kind of wrinkly crinkly white. It was so sad. <laughs> Poor Pepper. I also wanted to get bananas but golly I'm just over getting those quality of bananas. They take way too long. 
to wipe it off at home. Ooh, there goes my knife. <laughs> I am officially out of gherkins right now, so the ones that you see on my plate are the last of the last. <laughs> gonna be in town tomorrow so I'm gonna see if I can find some like good peppers it has been a little bit since I had a nice crispy pepper and it's funny you you kind of miss like healthy foods when you can't get them or they're not available or the quality of them isn't the greatest been looking for them for a little while. <clears throat> Tomorrow is also the day when Andrew is going to be picking up his new glasses <laughs> and then the following day is when Regina is getting her new glasses. <laughs> okay. Speaking of, during the dreadful internet outage <laughs> last night, the kids were drawing. This is one of Regina's drawings. It's from, um, I can't remember if it's some show on YouTube or I'm pretty sure they said Prime as well, maybe, but yeah. They were, um, Regina and Jagger were drawing together last night. And I'm like, yeah, this novelty is going to wear off pretty quickly. Because nobody was really knowing <laughs> what to do. <laughs> we were all just looking at each other like, well, what do we do? That's when I started, um looking for something for us to all watch <clears throat> because 
because most of the movies that I have now have all been bought on Amazon Prime. And you need the internet <laughs> to watch them. Although, to be fair, um, most of the movies I have on my Prime aren't really the most kid-friendly. I do have some that are, well, some series that are mm, semi-kid-friendly, like, um... Fever some butthead and what is it called? Two and a half men <laughs> that has been watched to death. One of the jars of gherkins that I got, I think it's the most recent one, almost all of them were huge. I don't even know how they got them in there in the first place. <laughs> I'm always worried about trying to fork a pickled onion because I really expect it to go flying somewhere. Try to keep the pickly stuff away from the mackerel as much as possible. To not taint the flavour of it. <laughs> if that's even possible. I don't know, maybe it'll taste better. <laughs> When I'm cooking it, I cook it face down so that the skin is facing the element because I do like the skin but I like it to be as crispy as possible.
It's so much more saltier than the salmon that I like to get. So it's probably not the greatest of ideas having to, but this is probably the saltiest thing I'm going to have all day. I don't know what the salt content is. really fun dream last night where I went to an all-you-can-eat ice cream buffet. <laughs> I'm not even that much into ice cream so what I was doing I don't know. <laughs> but it was fun. They had like other kinds of things that you could maybe have with ice cream like churros and um, like wafer cones, different kinds of wafers. I don't even know if such a thing exists. <laughs> but yeah, it was a pretty fun dream. <laughs> I, I feel like I was there because I was looking for someone. I don't know. that is literally everything on my plate except for that tomato which is a little bit of a yellowy color so I'm not going to bother <laughs> with that guy thank you for stopping by and I hope to see you again very very soon mm -hmm.